20 bucks. You know, when I was a kid, this was a lot of money. Nowadays, it can't really get you nearly as much as it used to, but I put together a list of 12 things that are under $20 that are actually totally worth your money. What's up everybody, Parker York Smith here. Welcome back to my channel. If this is your first time here, we are a men's fashion and lifestyle channel. We talk about anything and everything to boost your confidence without breaking the bank. I want you guys to look good and also experience the benefits of how it can make you feel good as well. So if that sounds good, hit that subscribe button. Let's do it. Item number one that is under 20 bucks and is totally worth your money Urban Outfitters brand beanies. They have a bunch of different colors. Fall is upon us. It's coming for us. You can style them in tons of different ways. I like to wear them kind of tight to my head, sort of like fisherman style like this. I just picked up this white one earlier this afternoon. I've had this blue one for like two or three years. When you're having a bad hair day, when you want to stay a little bit warmer, when the weather starts to get cool, beanies are the trick. I like them in everything from a bold color to a more mutual to a more neutral color like this messed up my hair so i guess i'll be wearing a beanie the rest of the video item number two uniqlo solid colored dress socks again because it is turning into fall the weather is cooling down a little bit you're not going to be wearing your sockless no-show looks as much anymore you need some dress socks so ditch patterns i'm all about solid colors right now these are like three bucks a piece. They have everything from just like a classic all white, a little bit of an off white, something like a brownish, bolder colors like these. I think they're $3 a pair and you can get four pairs for 10 or something crazy like that, four pairs for 12, I don't know. It's a really good deal. Oh, I can't wear this, it's too warm. My hair is just gonna have to be wild. Item number three, I just found these on Amazon the other day and that is a wristband wallet. This is something that I wish that I would have had for years. I was actually just out on a run a couple of weeks ago and luckily I realized that my keys had popped out of my pocket and landed on the ground because I heard them hit. But otherwise I would have gotten all the way home on my run and I would have lost my keys. That would have been the worst. So a wristband like this, it allows you to obviously wipe your sweat off but it has a little zip pocket so you can stash a couple bucks in there or your keys or whatever and you don't have to worry about them jumping out of your pocket in the middle of your workout. Number four on the list, are zero UV sunglasses. Just because summer's over does not mean you get to stop wearing sunglasses or you need to stop worrying about them. The reflection off the snow in the wintertime can do major damage to your eyes. So having an affordable quality pair of sunglasses is really nice. I love zero UV because they do a ton of different styles. So if you do want to try a bunch of different things, they're like 10 bucks a piece and you can grab multiple different pairs as opposed to spending a hundred plus dollars on a single pair that might go out of style or you're just gonna get sick of wearing. Number five on the list are Comfort Colors Tees. I just recently got turned on to these. I've ordered a couple from Amazon. They are not here yet, but they are supposed to be crazy soft and they're only like 10 bucks a piece. It's just a bunch of different basics. They've got t-shirts, long sleeve shirts, sweatshirts, stocking up on those kinds of pieces that you can layer underneath other outfits or style on their own in the warmer days. Comfortable basic tees that's a no-brainer, everybody needs those. Next up on the list at number six, not all of these are gonna be fashion guys, is this Ruzel, I think it's Ruzel, spray surf tonic, goes in your hair. As Soon as you get out of the shower, spray this like four or five times in your hair, just comb it back, and it still gives you some nice volume, some nice texture, it kind of almost feels like you just got out of the ocean or something, so you get all that kind of grit to your hair and you can style it in fun ways, like, Mine's kind of messy right now, but you get you get the vibe. One of the most frustrating things for me is when I'm out and my hair gets messed up because it's raining or windy or I get sweaty or something and I don't have any way to fix it. So the next on the list are these travel combs. Look how small this thing is. It's a wide tooth comb. I will stash this in my back pocket when I go out at night and that way if my hair gets messed up, I can run to the bathroom, throw some water in it, run it through my hair a few times get control of my look again. And all of a sudden I can feel confident about how I'm looking as opposed to having to feel self-conscious about the fact that my hair that I may have spent time on getting ready and placing in certain ways is messed up. Next on the list is this Bucky sleep mask. I got this at Bed Bath & Beyond and it is incredible. 
I'll bring it when I'm traveling or if I'm trying to take a nap in the middle of the day, it totally blacks out your vision and it stays on a lot better than just a cheap eye mask would. You can tell this thing is like beat to shreds. I wear it all the time. I think they're like 15 or 20 bucks. Bed Bath & Beyond, highly recommend it. Number nine on the list is gonna require a little adjustment. These Ikea shoe boxes, they're sold in packs of four. Obviously I have a problem, so I need a ton of them. So if you're someone who has even four or five pairs of shoes, you don't need a massive collection and you wanna kinda of keep them more neatly together and make sure that they always have a place, this works really well. Another piece of essential fashion in the fall is a nice dad hat. I just found these on Amazon. It's the K-Bethos Vintage Wash Dad Hat. They have a bunch of different colors. I think there's a camo option or two, but I really love this faded gray color. It came with these like little vintage distress things on there already, but it doesn't look like it's too fake and the fact that it's just totally not branded. Perfect for a day when you wanna cover your hair or you're just wearing an outfit that's appropriate with a hat like this. Number 11 on our list is a natural deodorant. I use this one from Ors and Alps, but whether you use this or something from Native or Tom's or whatever, it's really important that you should ditch any perspirant. That stuff getting into your bloodstream is really unhealthy, so starting to switch to a natural one, it might take a little bit of a progression to stop sweating and everything, but I promise you that it is worth it. And finally, number 12 on the list is a scalp scrubber. You may have seen this in my grooming tips video, but this is a really nice way between days that you're not washing your hair, use this in the shower and just scrub it all over your scalp while you're under the water. And it really, really helps unclog the pores of your head. It gets a lot of the product out. It just is nice to not force you to have to wash your hair and still allow you to maintain as healthy and as thick of a head of hair as you possibly can. So these are on Amazon as well. There's links to all this stuff down in the description, by the way, guys. If you enjoyed today's video, I hope you did. Hit that thumbs up, subscribe if you're not already. Tell a friend about the channel. Go follow me on Instagram to see how I'm wearing a lot of the fashion pieces that I showed you today. Turn on post notifications so you don't miss a thing. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.